So how's it going everybody? It's the gaming dude. Hope you're all doing great. Today we're talking Fortnite and exactly how to get more frames. This tutorial will help you go all the way from 15 frames per second to 30 frames per second. Might get some potato graphics. Potato! Potato! No! I promise 90% of you that this game will be smooth. So let's get to it. This will be helpful a lot to the people who own graphics scores equivalent to mine in terms of power and performance. So there are two methods to get high frame rates. Yeah, let's get to them. So this is another two ways to do this. So you open disk C and then you go to users and then you go to your username or the PC name and then add data, then local, then you get to Fortnite game. Saved, config, Windows client, and then game user settings with I and I. Now you have to make sure that you set this mode to full screen mode, and then you're gonna mess around with the settings. So yeah, the resolution size X, you're gonna set it to, let's say 800 by 600. This is the resolution that I usually set it to. And then the last user confirmed resolution is the same actually. So yeah, you can even delete the command if you want to. Uh, so yeah, 800 by 600, the frame rate limit, well I usually set that to like 35 when I use the HD 5450, but yeah, we're gonna set it to 30, the scaled resolution. So yeah, we're gonna set that to 480 by 360, let's say, so we're playing at 600p downscaled to 360p, if that makes any sense. The resolution quality, which is set at somewhere around 30% or 35%, okay, we're gonna set it to 40. You have to keep in mind that this has to do something with these. I forgot to tell you that you have to add this command. This is full screen mode equals zero. That actually, yeah, increases the performance. I don't know how, but it does increase the performance. The meaning of this gameplay is not to show you the frame rates, it's to show you the, um, the, the, the graphical representation, how it looks graphically, you know. Yeah, you know what? Let's get like a Breaking Bad entrance. Yeah. What's up? What's up? What's up? There you go. Yeah, again, uh, another alert. Keep in mind to have a better frame rate. Set I suck at this. Set the resolution of the. Yeah, there you go. What's up? I know you missed your boat. Shit, shit, shit. It's a pistol. Shit, shit, shit. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna die. And here we are with the second method. So it's pretty easy. You have to set the screen resolution of the PC to 480p and it's actually pretty easy to do. The easiest way is, is to get to the desktop, right click, screen resolution and then you'll find the advanced settings and then list all modes and pick basically the 480p resolution, the first one you find or the highest. And then you get to the game, set the screen mode to windowed full screen so it can get to 480p and basically you're good to go. But if you have any troubles with the frame rate still you can get to the game user settings and mess with the scaled resolution which is you can set it to like 35% uh, or 65 40 whatever you want it it's usually set at 75% the lowest you can go in the settings of the game itself but if you get to the config file this is the lowest you can go but if you want to upgrade the, but if you want to upgrade the PC if you have like a core to do or something higher you can get a GT 730 or a GT 1030 I will leave links to them down below if you have a higher end gaming pc and you want to get that 120 frames per second then you should get something like a gdx 1060 or a gdx 1050 no amd variants here because amd gpus are more rare to find and that's basically it if you found this video helpful press that like button if you got any problems of course i'll try to answer you i don't usually you know that fast at giving feedbacks but you know i will answer you eventually and yeah to subscribe help me reach like 300 subscribers something like that we are at 250 i believe and i will see you in the next one peace you're so bad! <laughs>